Hey guys, what's up, and welcome back to some more Fallout 3. We left off in the pit heading towards the steel yard, I believe is what it's actually called. And I'm actually you trying to look for someone on the way there that will throw out... I'm not sure if you would call it a side quest, but it's like a small Have side quest. It's not even a friend? side quest. Bill's a and here she one. is, actually, a Millie. Dear friend. We've worked the mill together for a long time. Last week we were forced to choose someone to gather ink. What the hell, man? This kid keeps saying he's getting online. He didn't want anyone to have to die out there, but ah, there he's we a go. survivor. He can't be dead. You look like you can handle yourself. Could you look for him and bring him back? Um, I could probably do that. Uh let's see, yeah, I'll help out. Thank you so much. Just be careful out there. Bill would never forgive himself if someone got hurt looking for him. Okay, so like I said, it's not I'm not sure what they called these. It's not a side quest, but it is kind of like a small side 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 quest. I don't they're called something. Uh they're like un I don't know, they're unmarked quest is what they call. It. They're not really a quest, but they're something I think if we do it she'll give us some food or something. It's really easy to do anyway, so all we do is find him and luckily for us he is on the way to the steel yard. He's actually in the steel yard, but he, when we collect our ignots or whatever they're called, uh, we actually will run into him. So fairly simple, and then you go back to home, and I think she gives you something. I don't know what it is. All right, downtown. This is the downtown. I never said downtown. Oh no, downtown's this way. Uh, what is what the fuck is this place? This is the factory. See what kind of work these people do. That guy is soldering or welding some shit. I don't know what he's doing. What? It... I don't even know. Just gonna try cutting some metal with a saw and no sparks, surprisingly. Um, what do we got here? Another pit slave doing the same exact thing. Let's just continue. This guy's not even doing anything. Sitting on his lazy ass. And then here, down here is where we're gonna be later. We're gonna be all the way down there. And yo, I'll explain more once we uh, once we get to that. This person cutting some metal, which I don't know how that's even possible. There's a steel yard. We're not going there yet. Actually, it says that we. Why is there two damn things? Oh yeah, once for maybe it is, it is like a. I, I guess I do get a marker for it, but it's not anything. Uh, it doesn't pop up my quest list. Well, the arena, that's what it's called. Uh, anyways, in here we should talk to. Here he is, Marco. Hey, not so loud. The bosses can't see what I'm up to over here. Why would you? They'll probably thank you for the information with a bullet to the head. They don't give a rat's ass about you. Oh shit, I didn't mean to say that to you. Hey, not so loud. Yeah, you're the one Medea told me about. Werner sent you, right? I can help you out. Take this. It's called an auto axe. Nice, huh? I make them out of the old car parts the breakers drag in from the city. Do what you can with it. Just be careful around the bosses. Make a wrong move, and you're done. Nah, yeah, I don't think so, but... Um, tons of shit that we can do. So what we can do, this auto axe actually is very, is actually very nice. A lot of people um, don't use it as much, but this is, this is pretty much it. Show you it in third person. Let's go around, and you can just kick some ass with it. It's very, it's very nice. What am I? I'm trying to get out of third person and I'm not used to this game, so. I think there's actually some someone down. Okay, here he is. Okay. With the proper application of medicine, this man's injuries could be lessened enough that he could be put back to work, but not completely cured. The only way to end his suffering is to end his life. Do nothing, treat his injuries, or end his suffering. Ah. Uh, hmm. Let's go ahead and end his suffering. We just killed him. I don't know how. And I think some people actually thank us for doing this. I think it's her maybe that we talked to. 
<laughs> that sounds like something I would say. <laughs> Get out of my face, asshole! All right. Um, we need to go to the steel yard. Here we go. You're the lucky scab gathering ingots for Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good to see a little enthusiasm for once. Well, follow me. Yeah, look at the white bitch. Ooh, I could just chop him up. No one would even know about it. Still your duty, huh? Who'd you piss off to get that death sentence? Actually, don't even know. Look at we can steal some shit. And they don't even care, it's not even stealing. Darn, we're just gonna take we're just gonna rob your ass, take everything that we can. Uh nothing in there worth taking. A whole bunch of bottle caps. It's not stealing, it's not red. Oh shit, I didn't even pick up a conductor. Oh, well, we'll probably have to get rid of that later. Alright, so let's get going to the steel yard. And here, See that there's a trog, here? there he is. You'll be That's what a trog looks like. Those. And if you survive them, you'll probably run into those crazies that live up on the blast furnace. Tell you what, why don't you do me a favor? And get killed close to the door. That way, I lose your corpse, eh? Ha <laughs> ha. All right, I'm just gonna skip. I don't even need to talk to him. I don't know why I was walking with him. I was just kind of curious what he was saying. So here is the steel yard. It's kind of like the Death Valley, or like they say, you're gonna get a death sentence for just walking in here. And it's kind of like that if you're not like me. If you were like Mario Brown. You would probably die pretty fast. So, first thing you do is you can loot this guy's ass. And I, that's what I do. And I don't know if that slave outfit's better, but I'm gonna take it just in case. So, there we go. We already got. These are what the ignorance look like. So, I have two of them. Pretty simple. We just gotta find ten of them. And I think there's like a hundred or so. And if you collect all of them, they'll give you a special reward. But I've never done that, and I don't think the reward. Actually, I don't even know what the reward is. Uh, actually, here's some. Here's a kind of a cool cutscene right over here. Billy, not cutscene, but a little cool scene. It's me, your brother John. John, you remember me, don't you, Billy? <laughs> Billy. Hey, any second now. You're supposed to. And it's supposed to kill him. We're supposed to. We're gonna be able to watch. That's what they do. They attack you like a damn monkey. I don't know. If monkeys attack. That's how it would be. Um. Anyways, let's go ahead and find some more ignorance. Look at this. Someone set up a nice little place to to watch guard or something. I don't know why he would put it up here. It's pretty pretty shitty place. And actually, we get to fight our first one. And you see how good this works. That is why you use it. It is the key to the trogs. Human flesh. You can loot that off him. That's what he that's what they eat. So he's not just killing us just to kill us, he's killing us to eat us. Because he's hungry. And you go to the dumpster, you can find a few in here. Very simple. I might actually have to jump in here to get this one. And let's go ahead and continue up this way. I think if there's actually there's some more places I can go, but first thing I want to do is head in here. I think there's some health. Yes, yeah, see, this is why I wanted to go in here. And give me what's ever in here. And what else do we have? Nothing. Nothing else. Um. So as you can see, you can go way up there. It is pretty damn high up. I mean, considering you're all the way down there. Once you get up there. It is very high up, and that that is not the way up right there. It looks like it would be the way up, but it's not. It's it's collapsed uh, over here. So yet the the way to get up there is uh, kind of in that direction. 
if you guys are curious, you go, you can walk all the way up there, and there's actually people living up there, and they will ki try killing you, so you gotta kill them. There's a lot of ignits up there. Actually, there's a shitload of ignits, so if you really want all the ignits in the game, that's where you gotta go.